So you just finished mounting your TV. And now, it's unmounted. How to undo with Mike Montgomery. That's me. So your TV mounting project failed on you, and it left a couple of holes in the drywall that are ugly and, frankly, not as fun to watch. And to fix those holes in the wall, all you're gonna need is some spackling and a putty knife, along with a sanding block to smooth everything out. Then we can come back with the same color paint that's already on the walls to match. And quick pro tip, they've actually got an all-in-one kit that you can get for small repairs and fixes. And to hang the TV the right way, we're gonna be using a stud finder or properly rated drywall anchors, along with this cordless drill. Also, we've got a level to make sure that the TV is just that. For quarter size and larger holes, like these, you're gonna to wanna to make sure and use one of these, a drywall repair kit for a strong fix. First things first, let's remove all this loose drywall and clean things up. Next, we're gonna mark and trim our patch to size, making sure we've got plenty of overlap with the existing drywall. And now we can apply our patches and spackling with a flexible putty knife. We're gonna apply the spackle, making sure to feather out our edges as we go. But don't worry, this doesn't have to be perfect because we're gonna come back and sand it once it's dry. Fixing small holes in drywall, like these, couldn't be easier. All you need is a little spackle and a putty knife. I really like using this spackling because it goes on pink and then dries white. That way you know when it's ready to sand. Now that's smooth. And finally, paint. When it comes to mounting just about anything to the wall, it's best if you can screw into the two by four studs behind it. And to locate them, you'll use one of these, a stud finder. To operate it properly, just place it against the surface of the wall where you know there's no stud. Click the button to activate it and slide it across the surface of the wall at the height of your mounting bracket. And when it beeps at you, you've got a stud. Hi, I'm Mike. Did you know that every 30 seconds, a dad uses a stud finder on himself? Don't be another statistic. So you can mark that location and drill it out using an eighth inch pilot bit. You're not always gonna have a two by four stud to screw into, and when that's the case, you'll wanna use drywall anchors. Just make sure the ones you're using are strong enough. Once your first fastener is in, we can find the level. And to do that, we're using a level. Go figure. <laughs> we place it on top of your hardware and adjust it until that bubble is centered between the two lines. Nice. And once you know how to mount a TV, you can install just about anything. Let's go ahead and hang a floating shelf. And that's how it's done. So now you know how to patch a wall, find a stud, and hang a TV the right way. All there's left to do now is kick back and relax. That's a prop TV. So thanks a ton for watching, and don't forget to click right here for more how to undo episodes and additional instruction. Also, be sure to check out live-streamed Homeowner 101 workshops from The Home Depot. And as always, hit that like and subscribe button down below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody.